it's time uh, to hope that I know when the hour is going to end. Let's go do these ones. All of these ones. <laughs> At least they're all close together, so they should be, you know, relatively easy to uh, get. He doesn't know. So this is the great, this is on the great plateau. So I'll get to do some great plateau exploring after all. Hooray! Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna need Sidon anymore, so. Into hell you go. But yeah, um, I'm just doing a bit of recording for jobs. Just a bit, just one video. Can't really go that much above an hour, so. We'll see how that actually goes in practice, but, you know, you know, oh, there's a cave here. Did I do it? No. Oh, this is, this is the red cave. Okay. See, <laughs> the size of the map always gets me. What the hell is going on here? I don't know. Is this, is this like a, a mini game or something? Is it water? It's water. They're little waterfalls. That's kind of cool. If only it wasn't nighttime so that I could see. Oh, great. All right. I'm just gonna put it all on now. <laughs> I am really low on health, by the way. I guess the idea is if you want the mother load, you crawl on the walls or something. Or you have a boat so that you can ascend like this. Is it really worth it? I guess so. The question is, will it like... No. No, it won't. Well, shit, I should... I should you know what, it's fine. Just do this. Okay, I thought the balls were wet. But thankfully, I have my completely slip-proof... <laughs> uh, frog gear now. For cave exploring. That's why we did that now. And I have to remember that that's why we did that now. Or last time or whenever. So, there's a frog here. I thought there was a shrine here. Wow. You didn't even hide... Whoops. What? What? Hey, wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. We're not using this bow. Yeah, I have to... Turn on shrines. <laughs> Oh, there was a shrine in here. There is. Maybe not in here, but somewhere around here. I just somehow didn't see. Then again, I like haven't explored this area at all. Okay, see, so my I had an earlier complaint that was I don't like the towers because you don't get to experience the minutia of the game, right? And the only way you'll experience the minutia of the maps and stuff is if you go for Koroks. But Caves kind of offer a better compromise. Assuming you're willing to do all of them, which you're probably not. <laughs> I feel like I am relatively insane here. So, did I not mark this one? I guess not. Okay, there's a... Die. So there's a shrine probably in that little cubby hole there, right? Well, fuck. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, after each cave, I have to look at the clock because my phone is charging. And everyone knows that you get... This is going to be a trap, dude. Whatever. Let's see what it does. The Yiga dropped money, right? So... They don't want- Oh, you know what they want. They want bananas. Right? Uh, there we go. No? Okay. We're <laughs> just looking at it. Dead-eyed. Okay, well. And this is a waterfall. It's fucking cold, I guess. Okay, hold on. Let me- Can I come back in where it's nice and warm, please? I'm gonna just ascend back up to the cold. That's my plan, so like, 
I don't know what I'm thinking. I gotta look for this shrine, though. It's okay, Link. We can put, oops, this on. And then, I need, I need the, da you know what? I need the damn climbing pants, dude. So it's in this direction. And the one thing that I like actually cared about putting on, I did not put on. Swift violets and rush rooms? Don't mind if I do. Why do these glow glow on crypts exactly? Shouldn't they be on the ground where you run? And then stamina stuff should be on cliffs? Well, actually, I guess it's, it's kind of the other way around, isn't it? It's the Dragalia upgrade triangle problem I was talking about uh, five years ago. Where it's like, why would the stamina stuff be on the cliff that you can't get without stamina? Still, I just kind of wish the running stuff was not just on cliffs. <laughs> Okay, where's this shrine? It's gotta be in the cave, right? Well, no, that would say like below, right? It's probably like where the waterfalls are. I mean, you know, so far so good with uh... Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Oh, there. <laughs> That's the problem with these ones. Can't they like have, instead of just a stone border, can't they have a glowy green border or something? The, the whole idea of the shrines is that you can see them from far away. So I don't know why these ones don't. Maybe there is a reason for the, on the developer's end. Like some of, we want some of the shrines to be like, you only really find them with the shrine sensor. You like really have to keep an eye out. If that's the case, I get it. But it seems discordant with the uh, original idea of making them as visible as possible. Also, I like them being as visible as possible. That is kind of my preference, so. <laughs> okay, so it's in this cave and I just didn't even notice, I guess. Oh no, wait, no it's not. It's just all the way down here. So the question becomes, how do we get it up there? I think I'm just gonna make a flying machine. I think that that is all I'm gonna do. <sighs> There's that. I guess it can go up these, well, yeah, but then it can go up there. I think that's the idea. That's what they want me to do. All right, well, we can kill two birds with one stone. Oh, yeah, we literally can, okay. All right, um, it probably would be faster. Well, these are the big wheels, right? Look at look at this machine. Is there a steering wheel around here? Probably not. Whee! Boop. I'll just I'll pop one out. It's gonna be like behind the rock or something. Hold on. It's gonna be behind the rock or something. No. Okay. Oh, son of a bitch. And all the wheels are facing this way now. Wait, now? Hold on, that's not... They were facing... Am I, they were facing the other way before I attached this wheel, right? What, whatever, whatever, whatever. I hate these wheels. I hate them. We already know that. But y'all knew that. I can't believe I, I completely missed this guy when I was going into the cave. I guess because I was looking at the cave while up. All right, well, here's one cargo. We'll put you in the front so you can see where we're going. Rocks are so, like, sensitive. What fucking little babies? Oh, great. What's over there, exactly? Do you think these wheels are big enough? I guess if they're not, I have plenty of big wheels, so... This, these are all terrain, baby. Watch. We're gonna be able to go over this. The Ford F1 Focus, I don't know. I don't really watch commercials. I just hear them sometimes on the TV downstairs. It's so funny how many car brands, like I'm, I'll be driving and then I'll like look at a car, a car's brand and make, 
and like it'll be it'll say Ford and then Focus and then in my head the commercial the Ford F1 Focus will play on my head and that goes for everything even the fucking Wagoneer Remember the, does anyone have a Wagoneer the funniest name for a car of all time that still exists in the modern era? Take all of them He could what? He could what? Oh. Okay, I suppose that, uh, maybe, would he not let you have this? No? It's, <laughs> these tumbleweeds have to be, like, manually set here by the developers, right? Is it? Can I, like, break it? Oh, that's good to know, like, weapons won't break if they're hitting things that don't break. Alright, and then we go all the way back up. I wish I could do this with my car. When I was a kid, I would, uh, I would, like, wish, I think I talked about this before, I'd wish a lot of things in video games were real and, like, pretend they were real, or at least go, what if they were real? And then just imagine if they were real and just have a fun time. Uh, this is the adult version, just being able to swish your car up. Also, like, a more adult version is having, I think I talked about this, having the Ultra Hand to uh, pick up a car that um, decided it was going to speed ahead in the merge lane and then, you know, get in front of you in the space that you leave so that you don't swim into the car in front of you. Uh, and then you just pick that car up and then you just kind of like throw it in another direction with the ultra hand You know, is that I don't think I don't think that's psychotic, right? That's, come on guys. That's not psychotic That's not psychotic to want, right? All right, so we're gonna ford the river with our big car the wheels are kind of oh look at that Look at that. I was like, they're about the size of the thing, so it's not gonna work. Wait, I thought this was a little... Oh, shit. Well, actually, it's fine. You're just gonna... Oh, okay. <laughs> I forgot that the unsticking came after the Korok Seed reward, but... Oh, that's funny. The game like had to reset it. All right. This is cool. I, li I like this because it's like... You really are doing an all-terrain ride with the big all-terrain wheels. This is fun, even if they're like slow. This is cool, I like this. Like look, we go, whoa! Like I could have walked it up. Actually, could I have? I think this is shallow enough for Link to walk through. I thought that it wasn't, but maybe it is. So I guess I could have walked it up, which is what I was originally going to do before I was like, ah, it's too deep. This can go really far. I thought it wasn't going to actually make it up there. I was going to have to, like, reverse time it. You offer the crystal. Okay, well, there's our little... You know what? <laughs> this lack of health is psyching me out. We can teleport right back here. Because it's a shrine. I'm gonna go take a nap. Gerudo Canyon. I was thinking about it earlier. I, I hate how it's Gerudo. The Gerudo, it sounds so stupid. It sounds like you have food in your mouth. Gerudo. Gerudo sounds cool, slick, more like um, what it would be called if you looked at it, I feel like. Gerudo, Gerudo, Gerudo. Shut up. It's dumb. But it's, it is Gerudo, like, it's not like I could say, well, I'm just gonna call it Gerudo, because it's a made-up word or whatever. I mean, it is a made-up word. And then you go, oh, well, <laughs> look at this. Every, every word is made up, dude. Every word is made up. Did you know that? Bro. I'm like, I, I'm getting a million rock salts from all these ore deposits in these caves, so I'm like, why not? 
Why not? I guess, maybe that's what they were thinking when they're like, we're still gonna make it cost salt. It's like basically free anyway, right? Okay, anyway, we just did this. So we're gonna go back over here and we got this. Uh, is there a closer? Yeah, you know what? This will be better. If not, I was gonna go to the great maze in the sky. I can't, <laughs> I spent so long on that maze. Oh, and I received a, tech, a text message. I'm just making sure it's not from a client. Through the power of technology, I can open my text messages in the thing. Okay. Well, I'm not going to worry about that. I'm not going to worry about that message I got. Okay. You can open your text messages in the browser. You can probably do that with Apple as well. But you can do it with Android. Okay. Korok puzzle makes sense to me. Like there's probably something down there, but unfortunately, with the cave, the cave minutia is not min minute enough for this. That's where the Koroks still come in, I think. I ha I'd have to imagine. I like put a Korok in every little interesting area. That's how I would do it. There's Gliok, he's vibing. Fourteen. I mean, I could. Do you want? Do you want? Uh, uh, uh. Like, do you want to go get an upgrade? I probably should, right? Fourteen is enough for an upgrade, right? Let's just let's just do it. Because odds are, while we're exploring caves, we're gonna find more shields or bows or whatever I want to upgrade. Probably bows. Because I never actually use shields, so I don't mind throwing out a really good one. Because I was never going to use it anyway. Oh wait, he's not here anymore. The episode where I finally found him in here went up. <laughs> uh, God. I guess what I could have done if I couldn't if I couldn't find him is I could have thought, well, he's probably going to go. I didn't know that he went to the Korok Forest in Breath of the Wild because I never found him. So I probably wouldn't have thought of this, but maybe I could have thought like if I do, the, if I get to the Korok Forest, then I can force him to start spawning there because odds are he'll start spawning there once I clean it out. Maybe. Seventeen. Bitch. You're making me waste everyone's time, including my own. Okay, well now we know that it's seventeen. Yeah, we're still in Gerudo Valley. So we'll keep the pants on, I guess. Well no, it's morning. It's gonna get hot. Right? So we should keep Sidon out. Hey everybody! Sidon's back! That wasn't supposed to be a it wasn't supposed to be a Spongebob reference. It was supposed to be a, uh, the most unwanted song reference. Does anyone even know the most unwanted song? A bunch of, a bunch of guys got together and like did extensive research on all the things that people hate most in songs and then put them all in one song that's 30 minutes long. And one of the things is singing children. So just, Randomly throughout the song, there will just be kids that just come in and will <laughs> sing about holidays and doing your shopping at Walmart. Hey, everybody! It's Easter time! Do 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 Easter time! Easter time! I actually don't know the, the all the lyrics. But <laughs> Halloween! Halloween! Candy corn and uh, ah, damn it! I thought I knew that one at least. Halloween, what a scream. Do all your shopping at Walmart. Okay, anyway. <laughs> Forgot he's a fire enemy, which means he dies immediately. Woo, up in smoke. I didn't think he would actually go up in smoke though. That's insane. Okay, so this cave here. Is this it? Yeah, this is it, okay. It didn't look like a cave. 
lower spectacle rock cave. And I remember why I had, uh, I had the hammers out. Because we're doing cave sporing. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. There's gonna be a third one, right? No, that would have been funny. The mother woe. Is there like like hovering right over it? You're just here. I guess I guess the the thing with this cave is just finding it. Whoops. Well, I would have found it anyway with the beams of light, so I don't feel that bad. Uh, okay, back to the other less durable one, so we can just pick up as pick up many more. What was that a reference to? I think it was. I think it's a reference to the birth the birthday song. And many more. I don't. Some sometimes I just say shit. All right, now my question is, where am I going? Over there, but I can still ascend and then glide down, right? Also, did the frog thing wear off? Or does it not reach this far? This far. It's not even that far. Maybe it doesn't reach this far. But the heat is unbearable still. How does it not reach this far? I'm just doing this to match. Probably should keep... Oh wait, I was gonna say the climbing pants. Don't have them. But the red shirt and the light blue is gonna look terrible. I better go to the dye shop and dye the climbing shirt light blue for this little bit of exploring that we're gonna do in here. Okay, and the shrine sensor is still on. So if there's a shrine around here, we'll know it. You don't stand a chance. Do all your shopping. At Walmart! What a gruesome way to go. What a gruesome way to watch someone go and then like have it happen to you. I think all three of them hit. Should have tried to shoot him again, but whatever. Money is not a problem for me, so I'm not gonna put that much thought and effort into it. And you know, it's nice, even without the Sakura trees, you have the rabbits that, um, like, point you to where you're supposed to go. It's like, there are a lot of tools to help you figure this stuff out. Granted, you have to kind of know that the rabbits run towards caves, which I learned from a random NPC, I think, but, like, it's fine. Whee! Party lizard. Damn it, if I if I knew it was there, I would have gone for it. Okay, so now we have to find a frog in here. Yeah, I figured there was something like this. It's so funny, they put a luminous stone there so it's easier to see. The mother load. Just don't fall. Did you see that? Ooh, baby, and they landed perfectly, and I hit the mother load. He's like, he's chuckling. I hit him with an arrow in the face, and he goes, oh. I regret everything. Now I have to remember to look at the clock every time I finish a cave, okay? I'm not going to remember to do that, but I got to. Okay, so now this next one is... No, not yet, not yet. We're not on the Great Plateau yet. We can climb up it, though. There's just a well here. I guess there's just a well here. I don't know what that's about. There's a rabbit there, implying that that is probably where the green thing is, right? Mount Nabaru Well. There's water. There's water at the bottom. I'm not going to be afraid of it anymore. There's no reason to be. Oh wow, this is a cool little area. I love these wells that have like shelves. You know what I mean? Yeah, every every well is actually a motherload, and that's pretty much it. And maybe like a place for 
glowfish if you want more glowfish. I don't know why you would, but... Well, this is the place for... Oh, hardy lizard. Hardy lizard. So hardy lizards are in Gerudo Canyon caves? Is that what I'm learning from here? I guess so. If I ever need more. If I'm like, oh man, I'm too full health recovery uh, meal short from filling my entire meal inventory um, before Ganon. What am I going to do? I can come back here and it'll be just fine. Right, let's go to where that rabbit is. Maybe I missed marking a cave. I'm afraid to have the interactive map up because it really ruins my computer. It's interesting. It's not hot weather right now, but the horns are glowing anyway. Is it because it's... Is, is it not? Is it just because it's sunny? I don't know. <laughs> okay, now this is the cave. The green cave is like right here. He lacks the critical information. He didn't even run towards the cave. What the heck? Prepare to die! Oops. <laughs> It's the sound effect. It's the sound effect that really gets me. Alright, well, for now, let's... No, that's not a... I thought that was a... Oh, well, whatever. The Stall... Stallry Plateau Cave. Stallry Plateau. Are you okay? Are you afraid of the lizard that was out there? They are kind of assholes. Ah, the frog is haunting. This is barely even a cave. Whoop, oh my. <laughs> I thought I was only like, you know, throwing one. Well, while there's a weapon there, let's just grab that. That you could see, you saw them spawn in. You can see them, like, fall to the ground a bit because they respond in the air there. Watch this. No. And I think ice enemies just melt in a similar fashion, don't they? Well, we're definitely getting the fire breath lizard stuff, which is good. I have a question that th they should say where you're meeting up, right? Maybe the game doesn't, isn't good at telling you where everything is. Anyway, um, so there's that cave. The Great Plateau, we can just climb it. Yay! Hold on. We're not climbing it. I was close though, I was close. I have to remember Sky Islands exist. We haven't really been exploring them for a while, so they're hard to remember sometimes. All right. We're going towards perp. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have a problem gliding down to where we want to go. Actually, I should probably put some, like, cold on. Something like that. All right. I mean, it's, just, it's where that mountain is, right? I guess while we're here, we can see the temple time. It's not called the temple time anymore. Right? Isn't it called like the defunct temple or something like that? The old temple. It's probably more accurate. Cave is probably in there, right? Yeah. It's over there. Are they carrying snowballs? That's kind of funny. Who's down there? Ice lizard? That looks like silver lizard. Yeah, he has the scythe on his head. We don't need that yet.
Part of me wants to like go down and get the uh, the Great Plateau. Uh... Oh, you know the Great the Great Plateau Light route Roots. Well, guess what? There's gonna be another one. There's the funny bridge. Okay, so question is, where is the cave? Also, don't want you annoying me. He has a chest. Okay, we get it. Yep. I know, I know there's a cave around here, okay? Five arrows and an arrow Kuda eyeball. Okay, now my question is, where's the cave entrance? It's the way it was marked on the map. See ya. Implies that it was like in this wall. Maybe it's down here. Still down below, so it's here? Behind the waterfall. I saw the rabbit. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay, and we'll kill the ice like like because we need your stone. A little too early to one. It's so much easier than just running up to him. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Wait, this is actually better than uh Well that shield guard up. I'd rather have durability. Is that is that true? Would I rather have durability? I don't know. But presumably the cave is here. Did drop a rupee over here? I mean, who's it where's this cave? Is this it? Okay, this is it. Gnarled stick. Womp. You can hear the, the cave shrine music. Maybe this is like... No, there's an enemy. I was gonna say, maybe it's like, oh, you, you found it behind the waterfall. That's its own reward. Okay, cool. Now my question is, where's the frog? Uh, they all have durability up, so. It's in a direction. Ah! He's, he's taking cover. Nope. When was the last time they get they got to blow their bubbles? Because they're bubble frogs. And yet I call them booble. Every single time. Okay, well we did that cave. There's that cave now. I love that. I love you can jump through stalactites. All the way up the mountain, what? Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. <laughs> Come on, man. Guess that's why there are stalactites there. Ah, uh, isn't this so nostalgic, I think? You know, let's go to the Temple of Time over here. Do you actually have to climb up here? Or wasn't there like a... No, I don't, I don't remember. Is this the old guy's house where he like taught you to cook or something? It, there was a gap with the tree you had to... You had to like cut down a tree and because you couldn't magnesis it, you had to cut it down in the right way. And because you couldn't ultra hand it. Hey, wait, do you think that Korok is still there? No, they changed it a little. There's still this Korok though. Do you think there's a well? <laughs> 17, se <laughs> I love that you can do that, it's so funny. Woo! That's nice. That's a nice haul. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. We're just one big jump away. All right. Let's see what's up with you. 
Probably just a statue you can pray at and that's it. Nothing really interesting. I love this was the like last spring. Yeah, you you just glow because you're a new statue. Why don't the ones in town do that, huh? You have a bunch of little babies. Oh, I'm trapped under the water behind the stone gate. <laughs> this is weird to come to the like holy statue that's like, I will bestow you power. I am trapped under the water behind the stone gate of the great plateau. Under, what do you mean? Behind the stone gate? Is this the stone gate? Under the water behind the stone gate? Now, are you talking about this? I don't know, but let's go do it. We're getting sidetracked, baby, yeah. Let's get sidetracked, man. Kill some stupid birds, yeah. That's what you get for messing with me. So fucked up that you like barely even have to go here. I mean, you don't have to go here at all. Is there a monster? Oh. We haven't seen a chew in so long. I forgot that was what it sounded like. They really should have tried to rebuild this after the whole calamity thing. Interesting. Maybe lightning struck it down. Not interested. Is that trapped under the water? There's a bubble frog nearby? Huh? Maybe I missed a cave over here. I mean, you know, caves can extend forever, so I don't know where the entrance is. Trapped under the water. Korok? Ah. We're doing the Great Plateau, I guess. Um. Up the scallop. I mean, I see like a steering wheel here, but like, what's that supposed to do? I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this at all. But it is two Korok seeds. All right, here's what we're gonna do. What do, what do we have in auto build? Do we have one with a? Doesn't have a steering wheel, but that's fine. Actually, we can we can take one of these steering wheels. Three fans, sure. Three fans and a wing. I'm sure it'll work. Okay, and then auto build this. Wait, is it using Zonite? Why is it using Zonite? Was it. What? You didn't build it! Build. Did it actually use Zonite there? I mean, I, I guess it was only 10, and once I go in the depths, that's gonna be like nothing, but like... That doesn't seem correct. Okay, anyway. Hopefully this is enough. I don't know if this is going to even work, but... I think I... I think what you have to do is 
let go while on the thing, right? This isn't gonna work, and I'm just gonna be like a little annoyed. Did you know that walking would have been faster? Like, just get on it, dude. Just go! You're useless! God fucking damn it! You're useless! Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Okay. Wait, hold on. No. Give them time to start kicking up for real, then go. There we go. Sheesh. Is that Zelda? Fucking goddamn it. Hey, at least we could reach her in my funny plane after this. This thing uses a lot of power, as it turns out. I don't know if you noticed the power that it's using. Uh... Oh, this is the Cave of Awakening, isn't it? I want to check this out, too. Whee! Remember, it glides. It glides. <laughs> okay, so I have a question. Well, there's 17, if I want to go get the upgrade. Um... Zelda is... Damn it. I know you have to come over here. It's where the cave is. Your nature compels you. Where... Where go? Where dragon go? I think I could probably teleport up here and be fine, right? Let's just, let's just do this. Rest in peace, my funny plane. But I don't need it. And we have to find the dragon, which is probably Zelda. So I don't think any other dragon comes around these parts. Probably like much farther away and higher than I thought. Well, first comes to worst, we have that. Um, maybe it just disappeared. Thought that was them for a second. I thought this was them. <laughs> um, I mean, I see the shooting star. They were over here, right? Maybe they're behind a cloud right now. Maybe not. Oh, well, I guess I'll go for the shooting star and keep an eye in the sky. For them. <laughs> I mean, maybe it was the electric dragon and it's actually over here. Is this it? I guess. This doesn't seem correct, but probably is, I guess. Fuck you. Okay. <laughs> that is probably gonna make it so I can't get the electric dragon now, but... Two star fragments? That's insane. What is this, Animal Crossing? The feathered, like, weapons sh should let you, uh, glide farther. Maybe they do. It's so cold.
It's so, so cold. Please stop moving. Oh, that's why it's so, so cold. Oh, this is gonna be something. Well, I mean, at least, <clears throat> at least I'll probably be on top of a valley or something. So I can just glide down to the star. It's gonna go away soon, though. Yeah, I don't have as much glide as... I don't have as much glide anymore because it's cold as heck. Well, maybe it's not cold as heck. Maybe it's just a little cold, so... Whee! person what is that is that a Lionel I think that's a Lionel down there okay well, we're definitely gonna go investigate that all of my stamina look at this moving towards the dragon in slow motion this is how you should do it Got it, okay. Hello, Lionel. Now you're just a blue Lionel, right? The blue Lionels are like... Hold on, we can check. It's unfortunate we had to give it... Wasn't this where a guardian was? I'm almost certain this is where a guardian was. Blue maned Lionel, well, you're not worth it. Okay. The sun is kind of coming up real quick. So we got to get this shooting star. My goodness. Well, I guess now we know a blue maned Lionel is there if we want. <laughs> Should probably mark it anyway. Nah. I mean, honestly, I should be using the electric horns. They're like really good because electricity is just the best ability. If I could get Feroche's, uh, you know, armor, well, I guess it'd be mostly useless. At least with hot weather and cold weather, especially cold weather, like there are places that are consistently hot and cold. And there's like, a, I guess there's only a, one tiny place where there's always thunderstorms, so. Boop. All right, anyway. Well, I guess, damn it. <laughs> Wait, Sky Islands. Sky Islands can solve my problem. Yeah, we'll try to figure this out. There's a cave somewhere. I mean, I could like go to a soccer tree and find out where the cave entrance is from there or I could just use the interactive map I think honestly um, it's just at the at the foot like of the entrance of the great plateau like on the ground you know so where am I going specifically probably where this thing is blocking or wait no right there right yeah well, that's like so low. We can just glide there. Whee! We could do more than just glide there. We could accelerate hold there. Yeah, my, my guess is that the entrance is at the bottom here. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'm Link. <laughs> I'm drowning. Uh oh, I think I'm about to die. I hope it cuts to Link like lying on the floor, almost dead. 
Wow, what a traditional Zelda thing. Yeah, that's about it. <laughs> uh, and the Hyrule Bass. That's so good. Oh, hello. Wait, are these the same people? The goddess statues and uh, the Poe merchants? Interesting. Okay, there's a frog around here somewhere, though. But there's not a cave? Unless... Did I go above the cave that was marked? Ah. Oh. I went above it. Okay, get, get, the, get the fucking interactive... Interactive map, get the interactive map. Down to the Great Plateau. The Great Plateau, where we can see that there's a cave right over here. Did I have that marked correctly, like, at all? No, wait, no, because there's a cave here, too. Okay, so the, the frog is definitely in this cave. Gotcha. Understood, but there's also a cave here. Okay, well, we're gonna do the Temple of Time, and then we'll do those caves next time. Oh, well, we have we have nine minutes left. It's kind of insane. Okay, we're gonna also turn on the Shrine Sensor. Shrine of Light nearby. Well, there you have it. <laughs> it's probably in that cave. If I had to guess. Still not interested. So wait, why did Link wake up in the Sky Temple? I don't actually remember. <laughs> like, presumably he was kept safe there, but we fell down into the Ganondorf Abyss, and then Link woke up there. And maybe it's entirely possible that this guy is not gonna leave me alone until I murder him. Maybe it's possible Zelda's like, put Link there for safekeeping or something. I have no idea. He missed! Dude. Dude, I was standing right- how did you miss? Do I have an open weapon slot? No, okay. Well, whatever. Well, surely there's a reason for doing this big- this big quest. Maybe it's just to show you that the Poe merchants and the goddess statues are the same person. I didn't even... I thought this was the entrance. Durability up. It's 55. Which, you know. <laughs> well, I mean, maybe we can keep it in mind. That's glass. We can't climb glass. It's broken glass, too, so it's, like, very dangerous. Alright, wise guy. Put a whip there. Temple of Time Ruins. So it is still the Temple of Time. I don't, I don't remember this whole hole, this whole hole being blown out in the side of it though. It was a little less ruined in the first game, but the upheaval shaking the whole ground probably did something. Speak to you now from the depths below in the guise of this statue. Okay, interesting. Is this where you're supposed to, like, <laughs> go to the depth? No, because Robbie is where you're supposed to go to the depths. I direct you to the four chasms across. The Each one has my eyes nearby. Drop them into the chasms, then deliver the stones to me, who dwells in the depths below this temple. So, near these holes is an eye. You drop it into the hole, follow it into the hole, and then bring it to a statue. Well, I guess we'll do this. It, it, it breaks up some cave monotony, doesn't it? So, um... Venture log, call from the depths. Let's do it. Let's get it. Why not? Not 
interested in those guys. Were these here? They're like, you never really go over here in Breath of the Wild, do you? Like, I don't think I knew this area existed. When they were making Breath of the Wild, they probably had, like, we're going to use the same map for the sequel in mind, right? So they probably were like, we're going to make this area over here, but we're not going to, um, we're not going to really do anything with it in this game. We'll do that in the next game. Can you imagine all, if they did that kind of shit, can you imagine all the notes that they must have like written? Ooh, this is cool. All right, let's go. The problem is I, I can't glide. I have to like catch this thing. So I can't just like glide. Was that it loading? I guess because of the notification. Okay. Wow, pose. <laughs> Do I have a light route here? Yeah. This is the great abandoned central mine. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, so now my question is... Here? No. I have to find the Poe statue that's around here. How am I gonna do that? In the dark? I mean, it said it updated, right? You have thrown one eye in the chasm. Carry them to the place beneath the Temple of Time ruins, where the voice is coming from. Okay, so I just... Mark here. Then just carry it all the way over. <laughs> okay. I can do that. I guess. How far away is this? Remember, the map is smaller than you think, so... It's probably not that far. Is that it right there? That might be it right there. Looks like there's a minecart that I could have taken, actually. Because it's a mine. Oh, don't do this. Don't do this. Oh, damn it. My ass should have taken the damn minecart. It's fine. I'll just take the damage. It's fine. Is that it right there? I don't think so. <laughs> Good enough, right? Oh man, we would have we would have done a cool jump and everything, dude. I, if only I saw the damn minecart. If I saw the damn minecart, this would not be an issue. Oh man, this would have been so fun and cool. Oh well. Is that a light route right there? Yeah, I should probably activate that. Now remember, I have to like go on the hour, so we're just gonna have to finish this next time. Which sucks. You know I would go for an hour and 15 minutes. Is that it? Right there? This looks like it. So four eyes for this little statue? Or is it here? In here? No. Yes. Yes, it is. Whoa, okay. This is the big Poe Seller statue. Okay. Cool. This looks like a mech hanger. Probably because it is a mech hanger, actually. What what does it all mean? What's, what's it all mean? The goddess Hylia is a mech from the Zonai? Every last one. Okay. Oh, th this is a Poe statue. I... I didn't even notice that this was marked. Wait. Bargainer statue. I will sell you the whole Dark Link set here so you don't have to go looking everywhere in the depths for it. And I'll go, wow, thank you. OMG, thank you. I mean, honestly, no, 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 because I have to go up top to drop the eyes in. I was going to say, I can just chill down here. And I was like, well, I can just go to where the points are and then ascend. You know, I'm sure the minecarts just... All of them have minecarts, but... 
Nope, can't do that either, because you need a elevator, and I don't think there's a elevator down here at every single one, so. This is interesting. Which one is this? Kind of looks like the Zora hat, but maybe not. Alright, I'm just gonna, gonna get this light route and then go up to the surface. Maybe just get to the other eyeball. I shouldn't. What was that? Did you see that? Something jumping up here or something falling? What, what was that? Did you see that? What the hell was that? And where's this light route? Oh. <laughs> Whoop. Wait, I, this is the... I already got this one. Okay. Whoops. What a waste of fucking time. So I already did... No, I did this one. So now I have to do this one. Okay. Works for me. I think it's easier to do it this way. <laughs> and I could just put the horns on because I don't need all three to glide from here to anywhere on the Great Plateau. They go off fresh fruit. As you can see by them carrying around apples and stuff. Well, I think those are like, those are bowmen, right? Well, no, but some of them carry around apples, so. I love you horns. Okay, now. Which one do I want to go to? I guess it doesn't really matter. Actually, I probably want to... Probably want to put on cold gear. <laughs> Actually. And then, we're, and then we're good, okay? And then we're good. I'm ending the video. This is cool. And they're all just... I didn't realize the central mine was like under the Great Plateau. I did not make that connection. So it's probably frozen, right? <laughs> the eye is probably frozen. Super frozen. Uh, do I have a fire weapon? Yes, I do. I just want to find the eye. And, and, then, and then I'm going to drop it. And then we'll end the video. I just, I wanted to be next, I wanted to end the video next to the eye, so like. Kind of figured that was it because, you know, it was steaming like crazy. Oh, great. What? There's a Korok in the middle of this fucking frozen lake. Okay. We'll do this and then find the eye and then go in. You motherfucker, where are you? Oh my god, I have to glide from the top anyway? You're terrible. Look, I lost all my hearts doing that. That's probably how I lost all my hearts last time too. Just mashing A. Please. Oh my god. Okay, it's literally right where I am. I don't... I don't know. Whatever. I think you're supposed to freeze the water. I think you're supposed to freeze the water and not do what I'm doing. Yeah, also, this, yeah, this marker sure is gonna help. Mm-hmm. Okay, now you're on cooldown. Jeez. Fuck you! Fuck this! This is so dumb! Okay. They put ice fruit here, and I forgot you could throw it. I, I was like, I don't want to pull out an ice maker or whatever. Where is it? Three is not enough for this stupid puzzle, by the way. There, Jesus Christ, how much of my time did you waste? 18, god damn it, god damn it, I'm gonna forget. I'm gonna forget. Oh no! Okay, there were more over here. See, now part of me is like, I wanna just go get the upgrade real quick. It's gonna take a minute, you know? And then I'll have it. 
no, 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 no. I'll be fine. Okay, this is the eyeball right here. Drop it, don't pop it. And down we go. This time it updated immediately. Did you see it disappear? Why did it disappear? Did they just spawn it at the bottom here? They did. Look at how neat it is. All right, interesting. Are we inside of a building? You know what we can do to find out? We're getting quite a lot of these, so I'm just gonna start using these. Okay. And then I'm just gonna end the video there. <laughs> we'll, we'll do this next time. Very exciting.